leave here, you leave here not alone. We've been here together in the presence of God. We have heard Jesus, the bread of life. We have heard his word. We have been strengthened in faith. Our lives continue to be changed. And we leave here strengthened in faith. We leave here together with the love of God shining through us. And God, each of your lives are so critically important as God uses you to deliver the bread of life to this hungry and dying world. Each act you do in the love of God, the simple words of kindness and love and forgiveness that you share, the acts of kindness that you do for others, the ripple effects come out from you. And just as powerfully as you felt these ripples, God uses the ripples from your life to work in an equally powerful way. Each and every one of you here, no matter who you are, you are so important to this mission. And again, the more of you are active, the more of you that bring your pebbles to the jar, the more we are lifted up in the power of God, and the more together we accomplish the mission given to us. God's love shining through us, opening doors and changing lives. Jesus is the bread of life, and he uses us to bring this bread to the world. We come here together to partake of this bread and be strengthened, and we leave here to share this hope with the world around us. family, all your friends, these are the people who have loved and cared for you all of your lives up until this point. They've helped to shape the people that you've become, the individuals that you are today. Now I ask all of you in attendance, whether you're a family or a friend or whatever, it doesn't matter. I ask all of you, including the wedding parties themselves, will you continue to support, encourage, strengthen, and pray for Andrew and Lauren in their marriage? remembering at all times that God wants them to live together within their vows all the days of their lives. If so, then say, we will. Thank you. Now that Andrew and Lauren have committed themselves to each other in holy matrimony, having given themselves to each other by their solemn pledges, and have declared the same before God and his witnesses, I pronounce them to be husband and wife. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. It is my privilege and honor to introduce for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Andrew and Lauren Devon.
Sing along.